What's going on, everybody? Hope you're enjoying your Sunday, and welcome to the Wrong Agenda Weekly Recap. So here's what's going on. We launched a new website called The Wrong Agenda, where we have news stories about everything you can imagine, from gaming to movies to music, sports, everything's there. And I'll be doing a weekly recap of the top stories, or what I feel like I want to talk about, from the week. So this is the first one. Let's see how it goes. Like I said, thewrongagenda.com, link will be down there, and um, let's just jump right into it. So we're going to start with TV, and today we're going to talk about The Rookie. If you don't know what The Rookie is, it's a police crime drama slash comedy dramedy show starring Nathan Fillion. It's actually really good. It's going into its sixth season now. Uh, I've been watching it for a while. The season premiere is on February 22nd, and they usually show up on Hulu after that if you have Hulu. Um, last season ended on a huge cliffhanger, you know, there's been strikes and everything going on. So filming was probably just insane trying to get this season off the ground, but the previews are looking good. You can read more about it on the website. We got some dope information, a couple screenshots, check it out. Next we have movies. I love movies. I love movies. I'm a cinephile. It's a thing. Look it up. Anyway. We got a lot of news for movies, but the top news is Deadpool and Wolverine trailer came out. Uh, I did a reaction video to it, actually. Who's asking? Is that? The TVA? Yeah, I'll put that down there. Y'all can check it out to know my full thoughts on what's going on and what I like and what I don't like. But um, yeah, we have that on the site, too. Check it out. If you guys are into Marvel movies, this is definitely something you want to see if you didn't see it yet, but I'm... Pretty sure most people who are into Marvel movies did, but here's the recap for those who didn't or don't know or just wanted to find out, you know, we're here for you. Next, we got Godzilla X Kong trailer. I did a reaction video to that one also. The new trailer dropped, showed a lot more stuff. This movie looks amazing. I'll be there day one, but um, yeah, that's another one you need to check out. Uh, They also released trailers for Wicked, which is a Wizard of Oz side story type of thing. Um, Twisters, which is a sequel to Twister, yeah, the movie Twister, that came out forever ago, uh, Despicable Me 4, Kung Fu Panda 4, and Fall Guy, not to be confused with Fall Guys, the video game, there's nothing to do about it, nothing to do with it at all, which saddened me, but I'm okay. Next, let's get some streaming news, my boy Kai Sanat. Has a deal with Nike? What? Nike gave Kai Sanat a deal. I can't be more excited about this. I hope more things like this goes on. I hope hope streamers all across the board are getting deals like this. I don't know what he's going to promote, what they're going to have. Maybe some Kai Sanat sneakers. I'll probably buy them just to support because I'm a big fan of of them and everything they're doing over there. Shout out to them. Um, In gaming, we have Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. They dropped the demo. They're dropping a part two to the demo this upcoming week. Um, Some people had some issues with it, with graphical things and whatever. I love the game. I didn't get to try this demo yet, but I I love the past game. I'm going to get this game first day of release. I'll probably disappear for a few days just to, you know, get to playing. But um, yeah, the demo I hear is pretty good, minus those little graphical things that they're going to upgrade with this new update and a new part that they're coming out with. Okay, moving on to music. I don't really have much to say about music. Um, You know, the Grammys came by. Shout out to all the winners. Uh, I know SZA was a big winner. Coco Jones got her first Grammy. Yeah. Uh, Killer Mike. Um, Of course, Taylor Swift. Don't be mad. Don't don't be mad. Um, Yeah, but uh, Meg Thee Stallion actually struck a deal with Universal, and she's going to remain independent get control of her masters, but still have the backing of the label, which is pretty dope. It's an amazing deal. You can read about it more on the website. Uh, I think this is a a good step forward for musicians and and things that are possible. And yeah, yeah, check it out. Now for sports, All-Star Weekend. Uh, There's all type of things I could talk about there. But of course, the major thing that happened last Sunday was the Super Bowl, uh, that boy Pat Mahomes, man. Which what can you say? I'm, I'm not surprised. 
Shout out to the Chiefs. It is what it is. I know a lot of people who want a lot of money. That's that's good for you guys. I, I didn't bet. And moving on, we're going to spotlight one of our previous interviews with Somatic, Sam from Growing Up Hip Hop. Uh, if you don't know who Sam is, he's a music artist. He's currently doing MMA. He is married to Egypt Chris, which is the daughter of Tretch from Naughty by Nature and Pepper from Salt and Pepper. And um, he's a great dude. He blessed us with a great interview. Uh, this one is an audio only. It's one of our older interviews, but definitely go back and check it out. And um, yeah, man, that's the weekly recap. Just Dale. See you guys next week. Next week. Next week. Next week. See you guys next week. <laughs> God willing. I'm out of here.